here. <laughs> oh my god! I am satisfied with this game completely right now. Hello everyone, Drumat here and today we're in a game against an Irelia on mid lane. Pretty nasty matchup, but since the W nerf on Irelia's, uh, it now only protects her against physical damage, so we have a little bit of uh, good going on for us, but we're going to see. Now, I'm playing Fulia on mid lane, oops, I am in Diamond 3 in series towards Diamond 2 on west. I am currently playing with the same build as last game, I mean runes and summoner spells, Electrocute, Taste of Blood, Iba Collection, Ravenous Hunter, and the Materializer, Cosmic Insight, with Ignite uh, and Health Potions with uh, 2 new 9 ability power and 15 health based on level. And we are against a team comp that kinda, we kinda outscale. We have Rengar, Lucian Pike, we have a better comp than them. Especially if their Singes isn't carrying solo like some do. And especially if we're going to play careful early where they kind of shine, especially on mid with jungle. They have some advantage, but we're going to see. Now, we're going to want to start very chill and casual. I don't know what Irelia does, but we want to farm just to farm safely and... When she does that, we want to punish her, but it's going to be hard, especially if you're not careful to those minions. Because... Like that. I want to prop electrocute, yes. We gotta do that often. And because she might full engage on us, we need to stay around the circle so we can full kill her. We're going to beat her, actually, if if we stay around the edge of the circle and we're just gonna do that and full damage exactly and we win another trade the Silas on top should recall excellent I've seen Lee Sin, Lee Sin is bot and I've pinged, I hope they don't die now Lee Sin is coming towards them probably or they just no. Yeah, it's still here. So... I have to calculate here a bit. And probably they fed, yeah. Kinda pissed they didn't back off. They had... They had pretty good advantage there. Here we get a full combo. And if we're good... We're gonna notice their Lee and we're gonna play around it. Probably I'm gonna get ganked and I have to flash towards Oh it's we good. Okay, so she's dead. That. That's amazing. That's amazing. Now she doesn't have any stacks on pot. But if I'm not careful here yeah I fucked it up. The flash Killed me, the listen actually killed me because if I played more safely, I would have had more time to actually react. You're going to die here to that Lee. If you're not careful now, at least bot lane is carrying me. So we got that going, but that listing gank actually kind of annoyed me. She flashed, I flashed. And she hasn't got anything. Go, 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 go. Oh. No, you could have killed her. Oops. Wrong minion there. Doesn't matter. Yeah, we're still doing fine though because bot is carrying, but I misplayed that. I should have killed Aurelia, but the flash is very, very useful against Tulia, especially in pressure zones and moments in which you cannot really do that much. Now, I want to do something here, so I'm strolling towards top lane. Oh, 
Okay. Okay, UL is coming. So we got the back the fuck off. I don't know where she is, but I don't want to get resets. I don't want to give her resets. And we played her. We played that perfectly. Now if she's level 5. I think I can actually solo her, because she doesn't have Ignite, but she still can come on you here if you're not careful. Okay, thank you. Thank you. That was a very good roam. From 0-1 to 2-1 by doing small gank, abuse only. I hope I get that minion excellent. So see when when the lane doesn't go your way, just try to expand your horizons and see beyond the point of Now I'm here prepared for an excellent roam. Uh, or a failed one based on I inted on that. Oh my god, I thought she was going to he was going to play way more aggressive. You can you can kill them actually here. I did an awful run. I'm in series and I play like trash and now it's pretty clear that I didn't had a proper game in two days. But yeah, you can still you can still triple them here. I'm so pissed when I fail gangs and the one thing that you shouldn't do is get discouraged. Because even if you fail, even if you int, uh, it doesn't matter, you just have to try. And as I lost the 1 versus 1 to Aurelia, because I wasn't that careful, uh, I actually made up with the gank. And now again I did a fail gank, and you have to keep that mentality going. And you have to really, really try your best there, because if you give up, you're just gonna lose, so we're not interested in that. Now the farm is quite close, and the lanes are doing fine, all of them, besides the one of the feeder, which is mine, uh, so we're just gonna try to play neutral here, get more, get more of these minions with minion materializer and play kinda safe, kinda safe, that's what we want. We don't want crazy on mid lane, we want roams. And we have two winning lanes, you don't need to win the third one. If two are winning, that's some math there. It's excellent. Ah, okay, I still got some poke. Another problem solved there, got fed. Uh, I'm confused about top, but doesn't matter. Bot lane is stomping, so top lane is not going to be a problem. I'm gonna get a plate here, and then I'll rotate top if he doesn't back off. Can get two plates here though, I'm dumb. Really dumb. Should have just abused the second plate now, you really might. Come in time to catch me. Come on, come on, yeah, that's it. This is the distance you actually have to keep from your earlier. See how the game went? I just died, then did the good roam. I then kind of, kind of didn't die. I mean, God. No. It was like that. Died, roamed. Died on a bad roam, came to mid, Rengar caught Irelia, 
and then we just roll with it. We did lose a drake, but it's cloud. It's a um, regen. Well, it's one of the best early drakes, but as we're going to scale anyway, that's the point of no return. I don't really mind. Uh, I need. I need to recall here. Okay, she annoys me. And the good thing is that she cannot kill me in theory. I'm perfectly safe under tower. I just have to not to waste my mana on irrelevant stuff. Yeah, I've seen the. You know, I don't have mana, but you can hold me if it's needed. Also, they are basically full AD because Singed will... Singed is not the kind of the AP damager that you expect. You, you expect Singed to damage one person in a team fight because that's what he's going for. And he's not really having burst, so they don't really, they don't really have AP. Probably relays bot, so please recall. Also, if you see one mistake that I do, and I'm not sure if many people observe, is that I buy vision words and don't immediately put them down. And here I want to go for a more advanced position because I expect Lissim to come to the bot lane now. Yeah, right now. One of that. Okay, go, go, go. Yeah, game was over here. Pike got those resets, just ended the whole game. Just reset after reset. Seeing their team comp, I would just dodge. Well, if I would be in their team. Having a Lee Sin and a Singe that won't do anything late, which is kind of the case in most Singe games, if you think about it, oh my god. It's not that okay, so to say. So you'll just you need to dodge. We have Rengar, we have Silas, those... Really? Those uh, champions are already monsters in the mid to late game if they get a bit ahead. What do you think is going to happen when you see Janna, Lee Sin and Singe? Who's going to deal the damage if you analyze the team comp? What I want to say is that you have to analyze very well those team comps. And one of the main reasons I do most of these videos, I try to talk about these thing comes because I want to actually help you to know when to dodge a game or when not to play it or when to play it more aggressively because if they don't win early in this comp they have no chance past minute 15. So we basically we basically won. In theory, as we are not in low elo where we expect I don't know, my ADC to go 0-14 after his 10 kills ahead, you, you won't really lose the game now. You're going to have those things, those kind of roams, but look, you have good players. It's very, very hard to, for them to actually do something meaningful here if I'm not bad. Which I am. Well, I actually got killed, so it's not that crap. And Pike is coming now. I want Pike to get kills. Okay. Uh, John, I got killed for the mate. Yeah. Basically, uh, it wasn't the best run, but I don't really like it. Actually, never mind. <laughs> Fed Ranger, that's what I was trying to talk about. Oh, okay. Basically, in this moments you can't really lose unless you screw up massively in in um, higher elos but again in lower elos especially especially oh my god if you have a thinkom that's not early oriented that's nice uh, you're going to screw up definitely with a team like that in early game 
you're going to get to late game, in, in a low elo game, sorry. So, what's the point of not dodging the game if you know you're going to get in late game, especially it's low elo, come on. And that's going what a fed tile is going to do, usually. Just nuke the shit out of their support. Sorry for the language. Okay, get that. And now we're going to get the mid tower. Why did the turn here? He might die. Oops. Ah, okay. Now, if I wouldn't be an idiot and watch other lanes. <sighs> yesterday, I, no, two days ago because I didn't play yesterday ranks. Two days ago, I was watching bot lane and I had the same thing, the same uh, way. When you're a bit tired, or when you focus on other things, you're just talking about as I'm doing here, you might not be careful when it's needed, and so you might do stupid things. Like that silence, how he died. So, you gotta be extremely focused and usually play when you're not tired. In my case right now, I'm not really that tired, but it's the fact that I have to focus on talking to. So that's two things that I need to be careful about, and yeah, it's a mistake that I shouldn't do, but we won't uh, really care further about that thing. And I really don't understand what they are doing. Okay, that was quick. Plus, if you look at the thing comes, they have no wave here at all. What? Sinjet is gonna tank the wave and push it into us when uh, we're sieging the tower? Who's going to do anything? Lee? Jin? Not really. Not really, no. He's not going for that. He's not suicidal. I'm not even wasting any mana on the E. And he tried a very interesting thing, but again, as he's least seen, even if he be 5-0 without destroying our jungle, I mean, even in that case, oops, that lift, really? Well, Just let me hit my W, please. I would have done more with that. Oops. Uh. And I'm in shit right now. How did you not kill anyone? Okay. <sighs> I wasted so much time there, knowing fully well that this thing would come, but this is a first time, and we're still. We're getting to late game, only Aurelia get the got some kills and they don't really have anything. If he, if Lucian gets caught and dies here, well that might change stuff. Yeah, this is just a waste of time if we stay here. Oops. Coming. Yeah, Lucian got caught there, and he will probably die, but he already dealt so much damage. Oh. I mean, I put a literal kill there for you. And only Janna is alive. Well, two drakes. Two important drakes, game's basically over. There's a huge wave here forming up. I mean, never mind, forming up for them. <laughs> so let's just stop that. And ca catch someone here. Now, Lee will come and hit him with the Q, probably. 
and oh wait wait oh come on you dodged that by accident I really hate when that happens I would not really doing much here but I'm gonna take what's mine and leave I had so many more times than required in this game I'm clear, I don't have mana, that's... <laughs> back off. I'm gonna do this in hopes, in hopes that he might actually pass it, but I doubt. I really doubt that's going to happen. And by the gold size I have, it would be okay if I'd buy a stopwatch. Yeah, he actually passed it. So, yeah, basically, we just have to scale with it now. Get drakes, get barons, get towers. They didn't really get any towers besides two towers, but got four we're gonna get more and they are in a bit of trouble there but, but I'm there with the team to assist him the good thing is that where is the rest of my team never mind yeah I asked where is the rest of my team without fully realizing that I actually blocked them with my wall, which is a typical Tulia mistake, so to say. But we don't care, and actually, past even through that, I'm gonna zone on the next track. So basically when I talk, I actually play like two divisions below. <laughs> uh, so yeah, if I'd be challenger right now, what I'm not, uh, I'd play like a master just by speaking. Even if I'd actually be in skill. A challenge. Look at the score of Silas and the score of Ranga. Jesus Christ. Oops. Can we focus more on the tower and less on the actual dying? No. I'm trying to help. Oh my god! That was the longest range ever. Oops. We got pooped. Oh, come on, and now Lee's gonna appear. <laughs> oh my god! I am satisfied with this game completely right now. <laughs> Holy fuck, that, that was... That was... Amazing, I'm gonna put it at the start of the video. <laughs> I really hope I don't forget to crop the video. So yeah, I'm gonna get another blue buff. Wait, didn't I get it last time? What the fuck have I done? I don't, I have short term memory, I'm a fish, okay? I have fish memory. Um, there you go. We're gonna need this, we're gonna do that. Probably taking too long to actually kill it. And I'm gonna put a word here and let's see where they are. No, we don't care. Oh my god, that was so close for a prediction. What are you doing? Where did I jump? Okay. Maybe don't do that. Maybe just disengage when your top laner gets randomly caught. This is funny. Ooh. Wanna see how this goes? Yep. Especially bad. But the good thing is that they chase Pike instead of going straight to Baron. That Pike trolls them. Baron, Baron S5, please. Jesus Christ, yeah, they, they get so trolled by that pack, I mean, if you'd be a man. <laughs> okay, go, 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 <laughs> he keeps them busy, go. And he didn't even get caught, Jesus Christ, this, this is a fun bike. 
a really really fun fight. But please stop. Nah, he's dead. Can we can we stop doing that? I mean, you're playing with a zero thousand Silas. I mean. Yeah, can we fight this fight? I mean, we're not that silver. That was hard to hit, I'll be honest with you. Can you kill him? I don't mind, I kill So, I just... I was the only one that... What's this? No, don't, don't, don't. Dude, no. Why would you need that trick when game's over if you take two hits? So the problem is that he goes alone and he will have to fight. And he will have to fight Lee and Irelia. And we don't want that, he's dead. Why do you do that? Are you tilted, dude? I did, I did mistakes, I understand, but way less than this. Few were mistakes, if you were to quote Game of Thrones grammar. Okay, so they don't have any words. And that was a one shot. <laughs> right fucking there. Uh, let's waste some mana on this guy. Didn't even roll one shot like that. You know what? I'm going. Oh my god. That's a god. Right there. Okay. They back up. Okay. Motivated him to stop. Now I died so many times this game. Stop. Just go mid. And here, if you're not careful, you can actually spend all your mana without achieving anything. So just go like this. Dude, you're gonna die for this five. Ah, he's even rubbish. But we can't we can't do anything now because if we fight, we're going to probably lose. I mean 12 kills. I mean all of the kill difference is on Rengar. Without Rengar we don't have anything. Unless I hit a clutch W and we end the game there. I have some time drops now. Not we manage with it. Oh my god, he can ult? And then he can just get another ult. Okay. That was an interesting play. Okay, and I get some assistance. Well, game over. Never mind. Well, yeah, you've seen a, oh, a pretty basic game, I might say. But that listen to me was beautiful. Thanks for watching, I guess, and see you next time. I will let the game end, and I really hope you got the point about team comps that I started with. Listen with Saint, with listen in general is not a good champion, especially if you don't have a master player or so. So you don't really need to play that game if you have, so you can just dodge, 3 LP is not that much. Uh, if you lose 20, even 15 is better by the second dodge. So that's about it for now, I really hope I was educational in this video. And I want to see you next time guys. So goodbye and have a nice night day, wherever you are when you're watching this. Goodbye guys.